Days are cooler, nights are warmer, and I put the blame on you. Time moves slow, but my heart beats faster. With these eyes, I'm looking right at you, right at you. You give me something to believe in, just what I need in. Um, there's a Joe Rogan clip going around. I know you spent some time on Instagram roasting folk. Um, uh, so he was interviewing a- Adam Sandler, who you know I like him actually in serious movies. Also like that he looks out for his friends. So I'm not going to vilify him in this instance. I'm going to vilify the culture. I'm going to speak about the culture. The thing I'm, I'm going to do a Ruben now. The thing I can't stand about the culture. All right, play. <laughs> Play the clips, Vince. What did you do? How did you set this up? How come nobody tackled him? That like, was how... a fucking weird moment. Oh, it's the live weirdest. Moment. Yeah, yeah. It's like a guy just showing his ass. Like, you just pulled your pants down, showed the world your ass. Like, why did you do that? Yeah. I'm he sure. probably doesn't. He probably wakes up in the middle of the night uh, going, sucks. why did I do that? Uh, that whole thing was sucks. Yeah, oh, sucks. Yeah, beyond. Sucks. It was almost like a guy who doesn't know how normal people act thinking it, this is what you're supposed to do go smack that guy it got it became fucking just just went to a place that he couldn't get out of yeah and started it and, and still there he's still there yeah. in, in everybody's mind when you see will smith oh he slapped chris rock that's like i mean not i am yeah. legend yeah. not muhammad ali yeah. not insanely good movies yeah, yeah. guy's an incredible actor absolutely yes. he's been in so many banger movies yeah. he's a blockbuster yeah, movie star yeah, yeah. and people see him they go oh he slapped chris rock that guy fucking sucks god damn it terrible man, it sucks man it fucking, uh yeah it's it follows you around it sucks mm, okay well black people's business is really easy and free to get into these days like there's no cover charge so here's the problem you know you're the only people caring about it because for, I saw a bunch of people go see the latest bad boy. It was number one for several weeks, if I'm not mistaken. I think it has brought in more than $200 million at the box office. Clearly, it's not, it's not, it's not it's really hurting Will Smith, ride or die. Not hurting Will Smith uh, at all. $200 million. Yeah. He's okay. Yeah. You know, it's funny. Like, I was thinking about this. I saw, I was look, I was on TikTok the other day because, you know, Will Smith is constantly on TikTok now. And he was rapping on TikTok and it was, the the lyrics were on fire. I don't know if he wrote them, but they were on fire. And I was like, I didn't think, that wasn't the first thing I thought. I wasn't thinking like, oh, he smacked Chris Rock. That wasn't the first thing I thought. I was just like, oh, Will Smith is rapping again. Is what but this is this is one of those things. Um, I do something called In Class with Carr with Dr. Greg Carr, who's also on Urban View Mornings, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, right here on Urban View. And, you know, he teaches Africana studies. Uh, we actually have the largest Africana studies classroom in the world called Narrative. And he talks about the social structure versus the governance structure, something that other people wouldn't. Uh, well, people would know because I think Italians have a social structure and a governance structure. I think Chinese people have Asians have a social. You know, it's, it's how we act with each other and how we act with the rest of the world. The problem is with black people, everyone thinks they know who we are yeah. and that they can talk about it and that they have carte blanche because they've been watching us. You know, even the minstrel shows that Joel, uh, what's his name, Al Jolson and all of them became super rich, all Hollywood, built on the backs of black blackness, right? right? Them studying us, Walt Disney studying us, but then making caricatures of what they think. We, when we're actually making fun of white people on the plantation, they took that as how we actually are. You don't know us. You don't right. know us. You don't know what, what makes us tick. What make, you Just because of your proximity and those that give you proximity, Mm, they not like us. They not like us. They gonna let you in. They really not like us. I'm sorry. Sorry. Yeah. I don't sorry. Like, I, I don't understand. I mean, I, I guess it's, this is a, at least a little bit better than Joe Rogan talking about politics because I feel like he, <laughs> I, I, I like Joe Rogan when he was having millennials, you know, eat bull penises on television. Yes. As opposed to like talking yes. politics. Fear factor. Was, yeah, I like the yes. when he was on fear factor. Or even when he's doing MMA matches. Like, I don't want to hear him talk about politics. And so this is at least a little bit better, but yeah. legitimately it's like, it's an obsession with like, 
like to, for him to say, I, I guess he was probably just talking to Adam Sandler because he and Chris Rock are friends, but for him to say, like, every time you look at Chris um, Will Smith, you think that that's, I don't think that's true. It's such a blanket statement with nothing behind it, but I think that's what you have to do. And yet that's what, that's how opinions work. Right. My mama used to say opinions are like assholes. Everybody got one and they all stink. Your mama, my mama, everybody's mama, <laughs> Joel, your mama uh, got it from everybody else. We all said that it's a, not a, it's a common saying. I'm just going to just let you know that Joel Christian Gill is here. Uh, professor, fine arts, brilliant, brilliant, uh, Brilliant uh, author as well, stamped from the beginning, a graphic history of racist ideas in America. He did that with Dr. Ibram Kendi. We are here. We're having a discussion. My days are cooler. Nights are warmer. And I put the blame on you. Time moves slow. My heart beats fast. With these eyes are looking right at